We have neither summer nor winter, neither autumn nor spring. We have instead the days when the gold sun shines on the lush green cane fields, magnificent. In the days when the rain beats like bullets on the roofs, and there is no sound but the swish of water. So thanks to these police officers, I had a flat tire and they're assisting me in putting on the spear. What's your name again, police officer? Uh, so I am Constable Roland attached to the Community Safety and Security Branch of the St. Angel Mark Division. Very good job, guys. And you are? I'm Corporal O'Keefe Anderson, St. Angel Mark Community Safety and Security. Police in St. Catherine South are on the hunt for men who brazenly robbed a security guard of his firearm along the main road in Bernard Lodge, Portmore, on Friday evening. The incident, which took place around 5.36 p.m., has left the community concerned as authorities work to track down the culprits. According to reports, the security guard was approached by men on a motorcycle while in the vicinity of Clifton District. The assailants pounced on the guard, forcibly taking his loaded firearm before speeding off. The daylight robbery has sparked concerns over safety in the area as criminals grow more bold in their attacks. The Portmore Criminal Investigation Branch has launched a full-scale investigation into the incident as detectives work to gather information on the suspects and recover the stolen weapon. Authorities are appealing to anyone who may have witnessed the robbery or have information on the men involved to come forward and assist in their efforts to solve the case. Law enforcement continues to increase its presence in the area as part of ongoing efforts to combat crime and ensure the safety of residents and security personnel alike. Law enforcement officials are working to identify a man who was shot and killed during an alleged confrontation with police in Fraser's Content St. Catherine on Monday night. The incident occurred around 10.15 p.m. during a joint police and military operation in the area. According to reports, the police and military team were patrolling Fraser's Boulevard when they encountered the man along the roadway. It is alleged that the man pulled a firearm and pointed it at the officers. In response, the officers took evasive action and opened fire, hitting the suspect. The injured man was rushed to the Spanish Town Hospital, where he later succumbed to his injuries. His identity remains unknown at this time, as investigations are ongoing. The Independent Commission of Investigations, Indicom, has launched a probe into the shooting to determine the circumstances surrounding the incident and whether the use of force was justified. As the investigation continues, the police are urging anyone with information that could help identify the deceased to come forward.
that has brought peace in the world. And I would say the great King Bob Marley did it so well. And if you know and love the man them called the great King Bob Marley, let me see a gossip. So.